Hey guys, before we get into today's video, I just want to say thank you to Tidewe. They hooked me up with some insulated heated bibs. These things are awesome. They have three different levels of heating and they are incredibly warm. Tidewe is having a huge Black Friday sale. If you need anything hunting related as far as clothing, they have a bunch of heated insulated stuff. They have boots, they have backpacks, they have tons of accessories and waders and some heated insulated waders. If you use my code EH20, you can get 20% off. Good morning, everybody. <clears throat> it is opening day of rifle here in Pennsylvania. I just slipped into the stand with uh, probably 45 minutes before shooting light. <clears throat> it is a windy, windy day today. I don't think we're gonna last all day in the stand, and I don't think we're gonna last sitting in a rocking tree. So as usual, be sure to leave a like and subscribe. And it was a pretty big hit last year when I did this. Comment down below what gun you're using today and let me know if you got anything. I love these old <clears throat> deer rifles, the lever actions, the pump actions. I have my Remington 700 30 on 6. So let me know what you guys are using today, too. I just heard the first shots of the morning. <clears throat> Much, much later than I anticipated. And they were actually pretty close. Just had the first deer of the day walk by. I couldn't get it on video, but the trail camera got a picture of it going by. It's just, I, it goes by the camera a lot. I think it's just a, a doe fawn or a button buck. I don't know. The shots are few and far between today. I'd heard 20 shots so far, and I'm in a big valley, so I can hear pretty far. It's going on 10 o'clock now. I'm going to get down for a little bit, go back to the house and warm up, and uh, try to be in here around 12.30, 1 o'clock. So, slow morning. Heading in, <clears throat> it's right around 12.30. I'm going to try to do some calling. Um, what do I have to lose, right? I'm going to go back into the stand that we were in this morning. Um, if a camera starts going off, maybe hit the ground. Try to spot and stalk. It's still pretty windy, so they shouldn't hear us in theory. So I'll see you guys in the tree stand. Just got in. It's still windy as all hell here. When I got up, across from me, I could see movement, but I don't know what it was. I don't know if I could see the neighbor's horse pasture and the horses moving in it. And you're talking almost 200 yards away. Um, I don't know, I just saw movement. I don't know if there was deer standing over there and I just didn't notice them. Ideally, it would be a buck chasing some doe because they like to chase each other around over there. But, I don't know. All I could see was movement through all the sticks. So, I'm going to sit, sit tight for like an hour and then do some grunting, rattling, doe bleeding. It's going to give it the full, the full send. See if we can't get a buck stirred up.
100% sure that's a butt bug. <laughs> Go figure. <sighs> Almost had a heart attack. <laughs> Over a butt bug. There's two of them. And I know there's two down here that like to roam together. I have no idea where they came from. But they could have been bedded down right there. They like bedding in this power line pretty bad. Unfortunately, you can't shoot that way. There is a house right behind where that deer was. And it's like 200 yards, so. Well, we're coming up on the last hour of daylight here on opening day. I haven't seen anything else. The wind is finally dying down. <laughs> 